Well, how do now, chums? It's a cup of tea with Captain Steve episode. Thank you, guys. Cheers. Well, I say cup of tea with Captain Steve episode. It's more of a VR episode. So we're going to be jumping into No Man's Sky, and I understand that Exo has got a secret mission for me to partake in. So don't you go away if that sounds tantalizing to your ear holes. Thank you, guys. This is going to be a treat for your eye peepers as well. So see you in well, VR. How do that, chums? Does I, Captain of the Steves, and yes, I'm back inside of VR mode. And Exo, I believe, has got a mission for me, Exo. Do you want to explain, my Captain little friend? Steve, the recently completed expedition Utopia, where you got the Utopia speeder. If you could return to that system, as I'm hearing reports that something strange has happened inside that area of the verse. If you could hit on up your portal, I'll give you the portal code, and hopefully you can traverse back there to investigate further. Right, okay, well, that is quite an interesting quandary, XO. So let's go and do this. Let's go and hit on up. The expedition whelped. So here we are. Let's hit on up into here. I don't know the portal coordinates for it, though, XO. Okay, so if I just head to my portal base, hopefully you can give me the coordinates. Okay, so here we go. Let's go. Kaboom. Right, well, I have arrived, Decatur. This base looks pretty darn cool, actually, and it's one of my simplest bases. Look at the planet just behind the base. Anyway, I digress. Let's head on over to the portal. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Now, I still can't do the old melee strafe jump. There's a lot of things I can't do in VR, like turn while I'm in the air. Yeah, because that's really tricky to do, to be fair. Okay, right, so let's head on over this way. And let's hit on up this portal. So, so I'm going to need this code in a moment, my friend. Hopefully you've got it for me. And hopefully I can activate this portal without having to put a load of resources in it. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Let's give it a go anyway. Here we are, boom. Okay. And do I have to put re- oh, sudden heck. Okay. Okay, well, this is squiffy as fudge, isn't it? Why are they down there for? This is a bit broken. I thought they had fixed all the menus. Oh. And I can't see whether I've recharged all of them because some of them cover themselves up. So that's a bit busted. Right, oh. I think that's all of them. We're done! I guess. Awesome. Okay, cool. And that, yeah, that's not exactly the best to read, is it? Okay, well, this is a little bit dodgy. This is a bit broken. And this is one of the things that they improved was the portal enhancements. You would have thought they would have looked at this. Anyhow, let's activate them on portal. Okay, that's pretty darn close to me as well. Okay, right, I'm going to need that code now. Okay, so let's have a little look, see if I can grab that code. And that code was up that the air. This is all, all over the place. The simulation and iteration makers. It's a little bit of work to do there, I think, people. Anyway, let's head on in. So this is the Utopia planetary code that I'm going to right now, people in the universe. Boom! Okay, well, I've arrived, Decated. Inside of Rendezvous 1 of the Utopia Hexpedition. Yes, I have. And you can see that there's player markers all over the freaking shop. Pretty darn freaking excellent. So, Exo, what's stage two of the mission, my little cohort? On your yeah. captain's log of the Utopia expedition, I've been receiving messages from the Burrs that the system itself is no longer abandoned, and there are, in fact, NPCs returning to this system. Okay, so you don't think this is an abandoned system, or you've been told that it's not an abandoned system anymore, that it's actually frequented and got, like, NPCs and stuff here? Right, okay. Um, Discoveries tab, let's have a quick look, see if you're right. Starball, paraffinium, bloody bloody blah. There's no indication of that, my friend. Um, right. Oh, hold on. Yeah. It looks like dominant life form is Gek. So this had an abandoned station before. Okay. And this is interesting. Let's go on up and let's visit the station because this was definitely an abandoned system. That was the whole point of the expedition, wasn't it? But apparently. Not. Okay. All right. Well, let's take one off and let's go check this out. Interesting stuffage. Okay. Right. So whoever told Exo about this, many thanks. Yes. Messages from inside of the real world. Inside of the real world. Okay. Right. I guess. Let's head on over to the station. There it is right there. Let's lock onto there. Pulse drive. 
it does look like it's a normal station. It doesn't say SPAC station in the actual description. So yeah, this is this is looking like it might be a restored system now. Now that we've built our bases on the planet, which is kind of what the, I wonder if they're going to add this into game. We'll get into speculation in a moment, people, but I'm heading into the space station. We're going to have a look around. I'm going to find a nice little spot to just sit and camp for a bit and just collect my thoughts on this before we pass back to Captain Steve inside of the real verse, I guess. Hang on, let's head on down. Diddly B. Let's get around the opposite side of this. Lovely. Spin this around here. Okay, right. Now I'm going to turn myself around and fly on in. Okay. Any second now, autopilot should engage. Well, I've land decoded. Let's um, get on out. Let's have a quick look see around. Pretty damn impressive. So, this is a fully restored function space station. No red lights, no slime, no nothing. It, it's a fully restored area of space with little gecks and everything walking around and even a little alien chum Okay, well, this is unbelievable. Hello, mate. Yeah, don't, don't mind me <laughs> Imagine how Okay, um, I don't know what to make of this. This is pretty darn awesome, isn't it? All right Well, let's go in this little vacay room over here and uh, we'll we'd have a little look soon we'll just, Let's go in here and let's collect some thoughts into here Freaking amazing people Let's have a look out the window but there we go, people. So it it has restored the space station. So it makes me wonder whether abandoned systems that we currently have inside of game and iteration, whether we might be able to restore them into working order, just like we did inside of this Utopia expedition. Yeah, do you like that idea? You think that idea is good, my little friend? You do? Oh yeah, yeah. I honestly think it's got legs. I really do. How about you? What's the stats looking like on that idea? Oh, no, he doesn't like that idea one bit. <laughs> right. Well, I'd like to hear what you guys think inside of the view of us. Sound off in the comments, because this is pretty darn gnarly. So imagine that if there was an actual mission to place bases of at least 15 parts on a plan on each planet inside of a, an abandoned system, and that restored it back into its former's glory and brought back all the fauna, brought back all the NPCs, made the actual station a living station again. I think that could be quite cool. I might even do that as a little side project, you know? That could be quite good fun. Well, that's quite a nice multi-tool that's spawned into this cabinet as well. Let's have a quick look-see. Yeah, pretty nice, pretty nice, not bad. You see, that's what the menu should do when you interact with a portal, is jump you back a few spaces, because we couldn't see the portal code that I put in. Could be people in the view of us. Heck no, we couldn't. But this is pretty darn freaking epic. You know what? I put the actual portal code for this system nice and big on the screen. So if you do want to come here and check this out for yourself, then you can. And also, you know, put down bases if you want to help people still doing the expedition, I guess. But there we are. And that's actually a thing. That's freaking mental. Well, I'm just going to go and save this and jump in my ship, out of my ship, and then be handing back to Captain Steve inside of the real verse. Because that's pretty darn freaking mental, isn't it? There we go. Save the guy, dude. See you in a moment. Well, how do that, people in the view of us? I am back from No Man's Sky inside of VR, and yes, what an interesting quandary. What if they do add that in as a sort of mission, to go and restore balance and bring back in NPCs and all that sort of shenanigans inside a normal space? Would that be something that you partake in? I mean, I, I kind of enjoyed doing it inside of Utopia. The only sort of drawback inside of Utopia was you could only build in your base confines and things like that. But then, even if that was part of the mission, I wouldn't mind because I've got all the base parts. And you can glitch the base parts in, and inside of normal space and inside a normal game, technically, you can just change the game mode if you really wanted to. And you could just go around restoring systems back to their glory and hopefully find creatures that didn't exist there before from bringing them back from extinction and stuff. So I quite like that idea, people in the view of us. Sound off in the comments and let us know what you think. Anyway, people, that's everything that I've got for you today. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.